Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math, and we got Thales' theorem proof. Thales' theorem tells us that if we have a triangle, ABC here, and the hypotenuse here, or the this length here, is AC, okay, that angle B right there is always going to be a 90 degree angle. So let's go prove that point right here. Well, what I will first notice here is I have, well, A, O, and O, C are both, well, congruent. They're both the radius because A, C goes right through, uh, or is the diameter, right through the origin, the center of the circle here. If I add another line here as well from B to O, that is also congruent, that is also the radius. So we have here that O, A is equal to O, C, which is also equal to the length of OB. And what does that tell us? Well, that tells us here that triangle ABO and triangle COB are actually isosceles triangles. They both have two sides that are the same length. What we know about isosceles triangles then is that the angles, the base angles of each isosceles triangle are congruent to each other, okay? And so, or are equal to each other. So we have angle here, O, A, B, is equal to angle O, B, A. These two angles right here. And angle O, C, B, is equal to angle O, B, C. Put two arcs there. So let's go label these angles here. I'm gonna label OAB to be alpha, that length here. Just make it a little easier to see. And OCB to be beta. And same thing with OBC there, okay? So let's kind of make that here. I'm gonna label that uh, angle OAB is equal to alpha. And the same thing here, I'm gonna say OCB uh, is equal to beta when I reference it here, okay? Well, what do we know now that, well, all triangles here, when we add up their interior angles, they add up to be 180 degrees. And so we have triangle ACB here, and what are their angles? Well, we have angle alpha here, here, for the first part, and we add alpha and beta, the inside, this big angle, A, B, C, as an angle of A plus, or alpha plus beta here. So alpha plus beta plus the angle degrees of beta here. We have the big triangle, A, B, C, and it's equal to 180 degrees. Well, from there, let's just do some algebra here. Well, A, alpha plus alpha is a two alpha, plus beta plus beta is a two beta. That's 180 degrees again. Hopefully you've seen where this is going. I pull out a 2 here and 2 times an alpha plus beta is what it's equal to. We have 180 degrees. Divide both sides by 2 and an alpha plus a beta is equal to 90 degrees, right? 180 divided by uh, 2 is 90 degrees and notice alpha plus beta is equal to angle ABC, the measurement of angle ABC. And then there we have it. We show or proven that our angle ABC is equal to 90 degrees. Hopefully this was a pretty easy proof for you to understand and you now understand Thales' theorem better. And we used it in our previous video. If you learned something and like this video, make sure you like the video and share it and comment and let me know what you thought. This helps us make more of these fun math videos for you and for everyone else. So as always, thanks for watching.